Right, I think? Yeah, yeah. I bought your real estate for sale at close at prices, man. Gas up the machine. She's down to fumes. No, wait till it's dark. There are too many of them out there. Hey, hey, it's no good to leave the gas tank empty. Suppose we need to get out of here in a hurry. Then we're shit out of luck. They're getting too riled up. Do it tonight when they can't see you. They know we're in here even if they can't see us. What good is it to leave the gas tank? The activity excites them. There are too many of them. There's more and more of them every day. If you get a lot more, come out and shoot some of them. Otherwise, stay inside the building. Stay out of sight. Thankful you live in the suburbs, Johnson. You ought to see how congested the city's getting to be. Miguel, come on, let's get below. Miguel, what can I do? You... What? No, I, d I don't need help. I don't need help. Come on, give me this. I'm all right. I'm just tired. You're not all right. You're collapsing from stress. You're now let me help. From stress. We're all collapsing. This whole fucking unit is collapsing. Everybody except you. I know you're strong. All right. So what? Stronger than me. Stronger than everyone. So what? So fucking what? Major Cooper. He died this morning. And then there were 12. Burial this morning. That's why there's so many of them. What's going to bring them tomorrow, sir? And the next day, and the next day after that? There are hundreds of them out there. Thousands. A million of them. You stick your head in the sun, they're going to come up behind you and bite off your ass. This is bullshit what we're doing here. It's crazy. If you've got an alternative to what we're doing, we'd be happy to listen to it. I got an alternative. Yeah, yeah, I got an alternative. Let's get in that old world. You're gonna find us an island someplace, get juiced up, and spend what time we got left soaking up some sunshine. How's that? You could do that, couldn't you? With all that's going on, you could do that without a second thought. Right. I could do that even if all this wasn't going on. How far up the coast did you go? 100 miles each way. Jump in here, soldier. We gotta bring in two more dumb fucks. Let's go. Two more? What's Logan doing to them in there? Get in here, soldier. It's been awake for 24 hours. Can't you get anyone else? What anyone else? There isn't anyone else. We're it. Two of you can't go in there alone. It's too dangerous. Christ. I'll go. What's the matter with your friend there? There's nothing the matter. All right, let's go. You guys are ready to get some of those plus gray bags. You got it, Steve. 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 You got it, You got it, Steve. 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 You got it, Steve.
think that's the last time you took any out. That can't be right. Oh, yeah, we forget to write them up sometimes, you know. You've got to write them up. It's essential. Can't you get that through your thick skull? How the hell are we supposed to keep track of how many we got left? Frankenstein gets him. If you're right, Rickles, then they're learning. They're actually learning. Come on! Come and see what I got for you! Come on, you dick faces! Here's a nice one hanging! Come on! Come and get it! Come and try to fight him more! <laughs> Sit still! Whip it out! That'll bring him on! Fucking A! Biggest piece of meat in the cave! I don't want to excite the lady, though. Not with her boyfriend around. You're incapable of exciting me, Steele, except as an anthropological curiosity. Oh, what the hell does that mean, Rickles? It means you're a caveman, asshole. You're a fucking throwback. You've been spending too much time underground, huh? <laughs> it's okay, Steele. Throwbacks all got big dicks. <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right, you dumb fucks. Get out there, you scumbags! Your old pal Steel wants to see ya! Come on! Shit! Come out! You're not strong enough for up here. Send up the pole. I'll wash out for lover boy. Don't worry. What do you mean I'm not strong enough? I've done it dozens of times. I don't want you up here, lady. Send up the pole. They're getting closer. He's collapsing for Christ's sake. Look at him. Let go of the pole. Listen to me. Let go of the goddamn pole. Here they come. Let's go! You dumb fucking bags of shit, I'll kick your fucking asses, come on!
just as afraid as I am. Why don't you take a sedative, Sarah, so you can sleep? You're full of shit, Sarah. You know that? You're really full of shit. Screw it with you. Fine, then. Get out. Just get out! See, Sarah, they are us. They are the extensions of us. They are the same animal, simply functioning less perfectly. They can be fooled, don't you see? They can be tricked into being good little girls and boys. The same way we were tricked into it, on the promise of some reward to come. They have to be rewarded. Reward is the key. I'm convinced of that now. Oh, come, I've got something to show you. That wasn't very nice, you know. That wasn't very nice at all. Let's go. And you can just sit there in the dark and think about what you've done. Think about it. Think. Call him Bub. That's what the club fellows used to call my father. Can you imagine a surgeon called Bub? Well, nobody seemed to mind, though. He was rich. My father was rich. He used to say that I'd never, I'd never be rich doing pure research. I'd never be rich. Uh, Bub's been responding so well lately, I let him live. Well, is he alive or dead? <laughs> well, that's the question these days, isn't it? Well, let's say that I let him continue to exist. Hello, Bob? <laughs> I'm going for you. Some nice things for you to play with. You remember them from before. From before. <laughs> I've seen the other things before, but the book is new. everything that he used to. Oh, I'm very pleased. Very pleased. What's he trying to prove? I saw one of those things sitting in a car in D.C. trying to drive down Independence Avenue. It didn't make me want to be its friend. 
what's amazing is not what this one does, but what he doesn't do. What do you mean? He doesn't get excited and doesn't get agitated when Logan walks in the room. He doesn't see Logan as... Lunch. Dinner. <laughs> Having fun? What's he doing in here? Don't need to that, Captain. He's quite docile. Come in. You can all come in. Bub won't mind. Say hello. Come on, Captain. Give me a break, will you? Say hello to your Aunt Alicia. Say hello, Aunt Alicia. Hello, Aunt Alicia. Hello. Turn a salute and see what he does. You want me to salute that pile of walking pus? Salute my ass. Your ignorance is exceeded only by your charm, Captain. How are we going to set an example for them if we behave barbarically ourselves? Take the bullets out, please, and let me have your pistol, sir. It's empty, Captain. We saw the bullets come out. Let's see what he does. Let's, let's see what Bub does in this situation. goes down the toilet due to contamination. You'll work with what you got, Fisher. But it's madness! Can't you understand I what understand we're... this. You and your playmates? You're running out of friends fast around here. Look. Major Cooper promised Major that Major Cooper is dead. I'm in command now, and I'm telling you that you work with what you got. And you better start showing me some results, or you won't have that very much longer. How can we show you results when we don't have the proper working conditions? We're in a desperate situation here. We need each other. Can't we just get you along? You need us the way I see it, lady. I'm not so sure we need you at all. Fucking A. I'm not even sure just what the hell it is you're doing it. Just what the hell it is my men are risking their asses for. Well, maybe if there was more cooperation around here, your men wouldn't have to risk their asses quite as often. Miguel Salazar's in bad shape. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> I want him pulled off active duty for a while until we can evaluate his condition. Can't spare him. 
He's over the edge. He's turning into jello. Jello? That's the way his sticks say yellow. Jello! <laughs> Miguel is seriously disturbed. He's close to the breaking point, and that's dangerous for all of us. He can't handle any more stress right now. Well, maybe I should cut off his extracurricular activities. Maybe you're keeping him too busy at night. We're talking about a man's life here, you son of a bitch. And the lives of others he might put in jeopardy. Maybe I should put him in quarantine. How about it, Steele? You call it, Captain. I'll build him a cage. <laughs> yeah, it might not be a bad idea. Give some of the rest of us a shot at some loving. Hey, it's gonna be a long winter. <laughs> it's up to you to get it working right. Lay off the fucking booze for a while, why don't you? And get somebody on that fucking horn. Pronto! Well, if we stay down here long enough, I'll have to lay off the fucking booze still, because there won't fucking be any of it fucking left. In the meanwhile, I will continue to indulge myself, and I will continue doing my best in the good fight against dry rot and rust. Yeah? Well, your best ain't good enough, asshole. Do you think I'm not aware of our situation? Do you think I want to stay isolated down here? You know, I'd make a desperate effort to raise somebody just in the hope of getting away from your nasty mouth, Steele. The fact is... The fact is... Either we are the only ones left. Or there's nobody within range of my puny little Second World War signals. We used to talk to Washington all the time. They could hear us then. We were on relays then. We weren't over the air. You know, the power's off in the mainland now, in case you haven't heard. And all the shopping malls are closed. We don't appreciate your fucking jokes, old man. Keep it up. And I'll shove that bottle of yours right up your wise ass. I've got better things to do than listen to this kindergarten. Are we finished here? No, we ain't finished here, ladies. Sit down. What else do you want? We've given you the reports for this week. We've given you you've everything you've asked You've given us a for. mouthful of Greek salad. Formulas, equations, a lot of fancy terms that don't mean a thing. I want to know if you're doing something that's going to help us out of this deep shit we're in. Or if you're all in there just jerking each other off. She don't have to jerk off like the rest of us, Captain. She got herself an honest-to-God dick to get off on, huh? <laughs> it may be yellow, but it's still a dick! <laughs> I said we ain't finished here, lady. Sit down. Sit down or so help me God, I'll have you shot. You what? I said... I'll have you shot. Have you lost your mind? No, ma'am. Have you? I just told you I was willing to kill you if you didn't get back in your chair. You didn't get back in your chair. God damn it, you can't shove us around like this. Since when did this become a military operation? Since I took over. Steel, shoot that woman. Bang! You're dead! <laughs> Shoot that woman or you're dead. You think I'm fucking around, Steve? You're wrong. Now you've got till a count of five and that's two you wasted. That's three. Four. What is this? Shut up and sit down. That's five, Steve. All right. All right. else have any questions about the way things are going to run around here from now on? This 
This ain't a goddamn field trip, people. This is a fucking war! I'm not down in this cave for my health. I'm down here on orders. Your orders are to facilitate the job of this scientific team. This is a civilian team, Captain, and we don't have to be subjected to your tyranny. Who's being subjected to what, Fisher? You've lost one man. We've lost five. Where does it say we gotta keep those dumb fucks next door to where we sleep? Where does it say we should do any one thing but shoot the mothers in the head? We don't have enough ammunition, Captain, to shoot them all in the head. Time to have done that would have been at the beginning. No, we let them overrun us. They have overrun us, you know. We're in the minority now. Something like 400,000 to one by my calculations. I haven't eaten. Is there food? You were supposed to be here at 7 o'clock sharp, mister. I know. Sarah told me. I'm sorry I couldn't break away. Is there food? Listen, egghead. Let me bring you up to date Excuse on what's me. been... Let Excuse me... Excuse me! Is there food? I'm running this monkey farm now, Frankenstein! And I want to know what the fuck you're doing with my time! If we're just jerking off here, I'm gonna have my men blow the piss out of those precious specimens of yours, yeah, and we're gonna get the hell out of here and leave you and your highfalutin' asshole friends to rot in this stinking sewer. Is that food enough for you? Where will you go, Captain? You can destroy my specimens, but what about the millions more that are waiting to greet you outside? Do you really think you can blow the piss out of them? All of them? They have you in a hopeless situation strategically. You're lost. Well, you're lost unless... Unless what? Unless what, Frankenstein? Unless you can make them behave. <laughs> oh, yes. This is a fucking loony bit. I ain't being paid enough to work in a fucking loony bit. I ain't being paid at all. Hey. Hey. Look at that paycheck, hey. yes. All right, hey. shut up. Just shut up! What the hell are you talking about, Frankenstein? I'll be able to show you soon enough. Sarah knows. She's seen the progress I've been making. Isn't that right, Sarah? Yes. There's been some progress. What kind of progress? What are you talking about? Make them behave. What does that mean? It means keeping them from wanting to eat us, for one thing means keeping them in check. It's controlling. What's going on?
apart in a matter of minutes, lady. And I'm here to tell you that I'm ready to do that little thing. I'm ready to take the next train out of here. You better know I mean it, too, Pete. Bang! You're dead!